Yeah, I don't know. Uh, hell, I, I honestly don't even know. Oh, you know what would be really out of left field? I know they're not going to fucking do it, but I mean, this would be just out of nowhere. An Earthbound game. I would love another one, but the creative Earthbound said he wasn't doing any more Earthbound right. games. And he he completely owns the rights to uh, the Mother series, not Nintendo. So uh, oh. Nint Nintendo can't be like, oh, yo, we're going to make another game. No, he has the final say. Damn. That's why that's why he's still able to make merchandise of off, off of the Mother series. I mean, good on that guy, to say the least, because, yeah. uh... And he very much, you know, is fond of this of the series and the franchise that he made, so... Which is why he continues to make products to sell for his um, own company. I mean, hey, that's fair, man. I mean, just... Uh, I, I don't know. Shit, because that's the thing. That's probably, that probably explains why we never got Mother 3 now thinking about it because of that. Uh, no. Well, I don't think it's because of that. I think it's because, like, Mother 3 at the time was very difficult to... to translate, and the themes that were along in that game may not be suitable for American audiences back then. Uh, yeah, and then of course now thinking about it, I don't even know if it'd be suitable nowadays. Yeah, because, arguably. Yeah, because there is a fan-made translation. So. Gotcha. <laughs> oh shit. I mean, there are multiple Mother Four fan projects. So like, well, I know one of them like underwent a name change like years ago and then at this point everyone's just like all right we'll make our own earthbound like game with blackjack and hookers in fact forget the blackjack <laughs> Okay, this damn fly is getting on my nerves. This is a party that I was not invited. <laughs> damn. Uh oh. This is how a comeback happens. Shit. It's okay, I threw a couple of lines. Maybe it'll oh, help. Hi. Uh, hey. hey! I think we were more pushing them towards danger, it just never popped up. Right. Oh. Oh, and I guess another out of nowhere. IP, uh, Kid Icarus. <laughs> yeah, um, yeah, there are a lot of rumors that are heavily surrounding that game right now. Oh um, man, yeah, it's definitely gonna happen this year, guys. It's definitely gonna happen this Ma year. I Sa swear Sakurai, it, Sakurai it's pointed it out in his video. That means it's gonna happen, right? <laughs> All right, I'm gonna get the damn fly swatter. Oh, really? Now you're just gonna fly away and get stuck on the fucking floor now that I decide to get up? You son of a bitch. Son of a bitch was like, oh shit, he's getting up. I'm just gonna. <laughs> what an asshole. Flies, the major assholes of the insect world. Do you think they're gonna announce a Nintendo 64 game? Cause we're still uh, we're still technically waiting on Mario Party 3. I'm not counting right. I'm not counting Pokemon because we're like 20 days away from Pokemon's annual uh 
personal direct where they announce all the Pokemon shit? Uh, I'm sure they will. And if I had to guess, it'd probably be Banjo Tooie. <clears throat> I mean, that's just a shot in the dark for me, otherwise, uh, I don't know, Bomberman 64. <laughs> I mean, the multiplayer was, you know, good. That, that, yeah. That's why everyone liked it. And then there was the solo stuff. Oh my god, was that shit difficult, let me tell you. From what I've seen, yeah, from speedruns, yes. Yeah. Like, I don't even... Oof. It probably wouldn't be Bomberman 64, let's be real here. Yeah. Ugh. And honestly, probably a good thing it's not going to be Bomberman 64. Ugh. Oh, you know what would be great? Diddy Kong Racing. Yeah, see, I'd like for that there to happen, but I don't know if that one would be plausible, Hall. Well, why? Mm. Why do you say that? Because, like, Rare and Nintendo and Microsoft all have a healthy relationship right now. Microsoft doesn't <sighs> give a shit. That's why GoldenEye is back. You know what? Fair point. I take that back. <laughs> also, yeah, Banjo was in Smash, and Banjo Kazooie finally appeared on the Nintendo console years later. So, I don't see why Microsoft will just let Nintendo get Tui. Yeah, Tui, I can see or more Diddy Kong. Than because mainly because Banjo's there. I don't know. My reasoning for Diddy Kong Racing is really it's because of the uh, race pass with Deluxe 8. Oh. I mean, yeah. Which, then again, it's, it's a one-shot fucking... Racing game, it's not gonna happen in DLC, oh my God. so maybe they do it, I got but... two people with that hammer. And they both didn't well, see it man. coming. Jeez. Oh yeah, the, the mystical ninja going on. Oh, another punch out game would be nice. See, that... I don't see Punch Out ever coming back because of the characters now. <laughs> <laughs> right, because everyone's culturally uh, sensitive nowadays, so it's just like, oh, I find yes, this offensive. It's just like, and it's just like, dude, if they want, if they could get away with it, and I know they're not going to be able to, they would have to at least add like one fucking like representation of like trans people, just a fucking like, they ha they would have to spice that shit up somehow. But the problem is, they would not be able to get away with that most of all because of that because it, it tackles something completely different and just oof like having the, the stereotypes of like all the races from the characters is bad enough as it is especially nowadays but that go with the, the, the extra step yeah no i don't see punch out going back unfortunately i'd love it to personally especially since on the fucking switch of all things because you know uh, i'm just saying arms didn't perform very well so punch out could definitely take that mantle <laughs> it's just the problem is uh well it would either have to be porting we punch out and just you know reworking it for switch uh controls or they had to make something entirely different which also means a new roster of characters and potentially adding more spice to the cartoony racism that it is. <laughs> and as much as I would like for it to be the Italian boxer pizza pasta, I don't think we're getting that. As hilarious as that there would be, it, it wouldn't be that. Ugh, of course, then again, it probably would just be the fucking clown from Super Punch Out, who I think is also Italian, but I might actually be wrong on that. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. It's been a hot minute since I thought back on Punch Out, mainly because, uh, well, they don't make any more fucking games of that now. Like, I think the latest one was funny enough, We Punch Out. It was. 
which was 2006. And I haven't even played Wii Punch Out. Me neither. I probably should buy it before the eShop closes. I be day to be fair. <laughs> you gotta cover all your your faces there, Nintendo boy. Before uh, well, here here's you know, the, here, here's the thing. I, I'm limited on on the the Wii U in terms of space. I'm trying to get the Game Boy games in there, especially uh, especially the ones that I'm planning to cover for a Let's Play in the future. You know, that's like fair. like Golden Sun, Duh, Dusk Dawn, or whatever the fuck the second game's called. Jesus, and you haven't even played the Golden Sun game since... Oh my god. I think it's been... I think it's almost been 10 years at this point. Or if it... I think. Maybe last. No. No, it's last. No, it'd be, it'd be a little more than half a decade at least. Yeah. <clears throat> the point is, it's been a bit. And ironically enough, I... I've always been planning to make that the next series on the channel, but then something else comes up that may I want to do instead. <laughs> oh man, Donkey Kong Country 3, here we go. <laughs> Listen, I've been saying this for the past 10 games. Just, it's gonna be Golden Sun. It's gonna be Golden Sun. God damn it, it's F Zero. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, okay, it's gonna be Golden Sun this time. It's gonna be Golden Sun. God damn it, it's fucking a Kid Icarus Uprising. Okay, this time, it's gonna be go It's three houses. <laughs> well, what if, what if, what if the next time? God damn it, it's engaged. <laughs> this time, it's gonna. Oh, it's. It's. Punch out. That I'm not winning and I'm distracting myself from everything. No oh, shit! It's a fucking battlefield! Oh my god! Go exotic butters! Go exotic butters! Mark their turf when they're not looking! Yeah, technically they do own Devil's Third. Oh, I don't think that won the battle, unfortunately. No, I don't think so. Ah, uh, damn. I mean, Exotic Butters at least had the right idea. Uh. <clears throat> what if, what if, what if, what if they actually ported Twilight Princess and Wind Waker? Like everyone has been clamoring. I, is that... <sighs> I'd like that, but I don't know. Also, I'll be right back. I need to go pee. Alright. You know what? This is a perfect time for a break anyway, so... I'm gonna stretch... Stretch my arms, but, like, I'll still be... I'll still be here. I won't run ads, maybe. Uh... I need to stretch my wrist. Do wrist exercises. Let's see if I can find your locker. There it is. That's a big ass locker. Can you tell how much I've been playing this game? Enough to double the size of your locker. <laughs> that just leveled up. Oh, oh my god. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah, Coliseum is pure Gen 1 logic disguised as a Gen 3 game. Because, because the only reason why Colosseum exists is so you could transfer the remaining Gen 1 and 2 Pokemon to Fire Red and Leaf Green and Ruby, Sapphire, and Emerald because they don't have all the Pokemon across the five games. Now I see I found your locker. It shift positions. Man, you know what would be just kind of out of nowhere for Nintendo right now, especially what they just released? What? A Fire Emblem game with actual multiplayer. <laughs> uh, technically, that's engaged right now. Really? It actually has multiplayer. I think <laughs> I think you could pair up with... I, there, I know there's a two-player mode, but I don't remember if it's online or if it's local, but technically there's multiplayer. Yeah, because uh, 
I know that they... <clears throat> so, <clears throat> I remember when looking at the, oh yeah, the Switch Online only section with uh, games, Three Houses was in there. Where's the multiplayer, Nintendo? I was promised, but, but I... I do I, do, I, do I have to unlock that shit first, or what, what am I doing here? Then I saw Engage, and I'm just like, let me guess. It's going to be like leaderboard shit or something. Because, uh... As far as I know, the last one that we had that had multiplayer were the ones on the Game Boy Advance. I th No, actually, no, I'm wrong on that one, because there was also the 3DS one. I completely forgot all about that one. And ironically, that one got me back into the series. There's like two. Which one are you talking about? Fates or Awakening? Awakening. I was going to say, oh yeah, that's right. There was another. Yeah. We don't talk about Fates because nobody likes Fates, apparently. <laughs> apparently? Apparently. Apparently. <laughs> <laughs> Of course, then again, to be fair, didn't it go down the fucking Pokemon route where it's just like, oh yeah, one version does one thing, but the other version does the other thing, and then they released a third version that concludes those two? Or am I nuts? It's technically stories, and the way they did it was like, one version was like classic Fire Emblem, but it follows like a linear story plot. The second one is like a more challenging Fire Emblem. Um... And the third one is like the it's basically three houses. It's it's the precursor to three houses. Where where like each story ends with a ends with a root, but the third one is the true ending. Which fun fact, if you don't buy it off the eShop before March, it's gone forever. I mean to be fair, they kind of cocked blocked me from actually being able to buy shit on the eShop now, so, uh... Can't do that now, Nintendo. Yeah, like I said, I had to bid it on picking that up, but the only reason I'm not is because, well, I've not beaten three houses yet. Well, you know, that, you don't necessarily need to beat it. <laughs> I mean, no, but... I mean, I've only gotten so fucking far in three houses, and I've not even finished it. Oh man, we're fighting a Norse god? Oh no! <laughs> Taya! <laughs> Why do we all go <laughs> to the right? Because it's all right. <laughs> uh, damn it, I walked into that one. <sighs> uh oh. Well, I'm just gonna stand here because you can't ink this. Ooh, sniper. Suckers, you and your damn missiles. You can't ink grates. Got him. I don't know why he was facing the wall, but he was facing the wall like an idiot. Ha 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 ha. Man, look at this wall, man. Have you ever seen such a great wall? Not the Great Wall of China, but it, this is a great wall. <laughs> ah, tits. And I'm referring to the birds. I'm referring to the birds, Twitch. You're fine. I'm <laughs> fine. I'm referring to the birds. I'm just saying, look up great tit. All right? Promise you, you're going to get the bird. Huh. What do you know? He's right. That's a great tit. Because, you know, someone was having a field day was naming that bird, and they thought it'd be hilarious. Just like, yeah, you want to look at a pair of great tits? Oh, yeah, here you go. You flash the birds on screen. Yep, th there they are. Th 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 <laughs> I'm funny. <laughs> Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
Uh, yeah. Someone is guarding the fucking crossway. <laughs> Taya, why? Was it because I was making fun of the great tits? <laughs> yes. The, the, if you had to ask, the answer is yes. But they're birds. There's such pretty birds. Don't die. I'm not gonna try, or I'm gonna do <laughs> Not gonna get me! No, 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 Oh, Speaking of snipers, God. I got one of them. And I got the other one. Oh, keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. Oh man, the tap dancing sniper team it gave us the victory. Yeah, th thanks, to you, thanks to you pointing them out, I was like, oh, I could just go around and stamp them. <laughs> Hell yeah. Easy. <laughs> I did it. I did all the work. <laughs> yeah, go me. I was a distraction. <laughs> uh, I'm taking all the credit here. <laughs> me and my tap dancing sandals. Yeah, we're, we got this in the bag. <laughs>